Hello, friends. Happy January. It's Miss Julie from Miss Julie's Preschool and Crafts, and I'm here to do a fun craft with you today. All right, we are going to be making asymmetrical mittens. All right, so I will show you the supplies and then hopefully you can make it along with me. All right, so what you're going to need is a piece of paper. First, I just chose white. You can use actually use any color you have available. Um, but I just got a piece of white from my printer. Okay, so that's the first thing you need. Now this is a painting thing, so you are actually gonna need some paint to do your project today. So I chose yellow, green, and orange paint. I chose three colors, okay? We're just gonna need a few little drops of each color, all right? And then you're gonna need a marker or a crayon. I have a blue marker here. And when it's all dry, you're gonna need scissors, okay? So that is what you need for the project. So the first thing you're gonna do to make your mitten project is we're gonna to have to make a mitten shape. The shape of a mitten is your hand. So we are going to take our hand and put it on the piece of paper and we are going to make a mitten shape. Now your fingers are closed together, okay? So, if you put your hand down on your table and you trace your hand around it, not with your fingers open, put your fingers together, you make a mitten shape. You need to do two of them, all right? So let's try to draw a mitten on our paper. Trace your own hand. If you need help, you can ask for help, but it's good to try it on your own. Okay, there's one mitten hand. And I'm gonna do the other one. The other hand is tricky. I put my hand down. I got my marker. All right, I made two mittens on my paper. Okay, so the word symmetrical that I use means that one mitten and the other mitten look the same. Okay, same. So what we're going to do is we're going to take our paper and we're going to put a few drops of paint on one side. Then we're going to fold our paper in half and rub it with our hand. And then we will get the same print on the other mitten. They will look the same. They will look symmetrical. Okay, so you don't need a lot of paint, friends, but it would be great to have a few drops of a different color. So I chose three. So I'm just gonna put a drop only on one side now, only on one side. I put a yellow drop here at the bottom. I'm only using a little bit of paint because it will take a while to try if you use a lot of paint. One drop of green I used, and now I got orange. And I'm gonna put orange here. Okay. I will try to hold it up and show you. This is what it looks like without before I folded it. Okay. Now I'm going to fold the paper in half like you're making a card. And the mittens will line up and be symmetrical. Okay, are you rubbing it with your finger? Okay, I'm gonna show you the reveal. Look at that! You have the same design on the right and the left. That is exciting. Okay, now, once you're done with your design, you have to put it to the side, let it dry before you can cut your mittens out and hang them up. So I'm gonna put mine to the side. And I did a little, I did another one earlier. I'm gonna show you the one I did earlier. Um, but I don't think this one's dry either, so. There's the one I did earlier, see? 
The design looks the same. They're symmetrical. Yeah, and then you can cut them out and put them on your artboard or your refrigerator or share them with a friend. All right. Okay, friends, well, that was our symmetrical mitten craft today. I hope you enjoyed it. I want you to check out my other videos below for other crafts and stories that I've read. All right, and I'll see you again next time from Miss Julie's Virtual Preschool and Crafts. Bye.